Today, the IRS begins accepting 2022 tax returns. But before you start filing, there are some important changes. This tax season, you need to be aware of. Destiny Richards in studio now with how filing will be different than it's been the past two years. Destiny. Yeah, one of the biggest changes is that some COVID era tax breaks are phasing out. Stimulus checks are now a thing of the past and refunds are expected to be smaller for millions of Americans. According to the IRS, the average refund last year was nearly $3,200. That was up from about $2,800 in 2021. Tax experts say refund amounts this year will more than likely resemble refunds from 2019 or 2020. Depending on a taxpayer situation, tax experts say refunds could shrink by a few hundred to a few thousand dollars. The first one mostly um, pe that people would think of would be the child tax credit. Um, it was worth up to $3,600 last year per child. Now it's back down to the $2,000 um, per child. Um, also 17 year olds, they got it for one year. Now they don't. Amounts will also be shrinking for taxpayers who qualify for the Earned Income Tax Credit and the Child and Dependent Care Credit. You can find more information about credits and deductions on irs.gov. This tax season, tax experts are also saying filing accurately and with all the right forms you need is more important than filing as early as possible. I'll share tips from the IRS for a smooth filing process coming up later this hour. Reporting in studio, Destiny Richards, 4 News Now.